guys, so today I'm going to be showing you four different games that you can play with your cat. You could also play these with your dog too if you want, but yeah, I just have a cat. So yeah, these are fun games that you could play with your pet when you're bored. And I was just scrolling on Pinterest and Facebook the other day and I came across some really fun games that I wanted to try with my cat. So I thought I would just film a whole video of fun games that you could play with your pet. So yeah, let's just get started. <laughs> So I recently taught my cat how to play fetch like a couple months ago and yeah so that's gonna be the first game but it looks like now she just wants to sit on my lap so we'll see if she does it. So if you're wondering how I taught my cat how to play fetch I actually don't know I just started like throwing this and then I would just call her name but she only comes when I say ko. Her name's actually Kimiko, but she only comes when I say Ko for some reason. <laughs> so yeah, I actually tried giving her a treat after she brought it back, but that was a bad idea because Kimiko loves to eat, so she just gets distracted every time I give her a treat. So yeah, that didn't work with my cat. Ko! 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 See, she's bringing it back. <laughs> Go. Thank you, honey. Thank you. Go. 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 So cute. Whoops. <laughs> that was a bad throw. Oh, you still got it there. <laughs> this is like one of her favorite games. Okay, now she's getting lazy. <laughs> okay, so that's the first game. So, whoa, what is that noise? Are we having an earthquake? I don't know what that was. So the next thing, let, I cannot talk today for some reason, but the next game that I'm gonna show you is Tic-Tac-Toe, and I actually found this idea on Facebook. It involves treats, so if you're gonna do this game, you should probably just do it like, once a day or once a week because yeah you don't want to give your cat too many treats but yeah we'll see if she does this i'm really excited for this one we'll see who wins at tic-tac-toe <laughs> Okay, so now we're gonna play tic-tac-toe. So I got the treats. So I'm gonna set this up and I feel like she's just gonna eat all the treats and this isn't gonna work, but we'll see. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to do this fast cause she's gonna try to eat all these. Oh my goodness, can we go? She's X's, I'm O's. Oh, looks like I won. <laughs> Sorry if you didn't see that, but like she went so fast. I told you my cat loves to eat, so she just went crazy overboard and ate it all before I could even write anything. But I won the first round. I was O's, she was X's. I think I could probably do this one more time. I know I said earlier, like, that's too many treats, but I don't think you could even see what she was doing because her furry face was in the way. <laughs> okay, here goes round two. Let's see who wins. Okay, Kimiko, 
Now don't cover up the camera this time. <laughs> okay, ready, set, go. X, O, oh, whoops, X, X, O, X, O, X. I'm getting confused, she's going so fast. Okay, who won? Oh, my cat won. <laughs> okay, guys, so it looks like we're tied. I won the first round. I was O's and my cat was X's. So, she beat me the next round. <laughs> Okay, so far I feel like that was her favorite game because she loves to eat. <laughs> so the next game that I'm going to play with her is a memory game. So I've seen people do this with their cats before. I think you have to have three different cups, but you have to put like a prize or something in one of the cups. You have to see how smart they are, if they can find which item is in which cup. Okay, so I have the three cups and... I have some cat toys. I think I might do three rounds of this. I'll start off easy with the noise and then we'll try the ones that doesn't have sound to see how smart she is. Okay, so we'll start off with the noisy ones. Let's see. I'll do this one. It's a little bit quieter than the other one. Okay, Kimiko. Kimiko. I think she chose that one, but I'm not sure. <laughs> okay, I think we need to go even easier because I don't think my cat knows how to play this game. Oh, she found it. <laughs> okay, that time it worked because she could hear this. It looks like she went to like these two, but I think she picked this one. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let's try this again. Come on, come on, come on. See this? Come on, come on. I think she's kind of bored with this game. So yeah, I think we're just going to move on to the next game. <laughs> so for the next game idea, I actually showed this idea in another video that I made like, I don't know, a couple years ago. That was actually my most popular video. So yeah, that video was called DIY Cat Toys on my channel if you're wondering. But it's basically the whack-a-mole game. I actually made a mistake in that video of using my finger. You probably don't want to do that because if you have a cat that bites... What in the world? <laughs> my cat's in the box right now. So yeah, if you have a cat that bites that you don't want them to bite your finger. So I would recommend using like a toy or a feather or something. But basically all you will need is a cardboard box or a Kleenex box, whatever you have an exacto knife or scissors and a little cat toy so you could paint this or decorate it if you want to but i'm just showing this as an example so i'm just going to start by carving some little round circles
Okay, this cat is too smart for all of these games. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video of my cat and all of these game ideas that I showed you. If you have any other video ideas that I could do with my cat, then just leave those comments down below. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Okay, what is my cat doing right now? <laughs> she thinks she's like the queen is sitting right in the center. You're so sassy. You are so sassy. <laughs>